Hello everyone, welcome back again to my channel. We are doing another League of Legends reaction video. This is for World's 2019 Anthem called Phoenix. Okay, it's Feed, Kaden, Russo and Chrissy Constanza. So, um, I actually had a chance to read the description of this video. It says, destroy your doubt, face the future, face the win! No, I'm just sorry. <laughs> so stupid of me but yeah um it sounds interesting uh, i have not really watched it yet uh we're gonna have a look at it um i don't know i i, I can't say anything for now let's just watch and react <laughs> I don't know why. What is it with League and Trains lately? Oh. Ah, uh, okay. So it's all these professional players. Uh huh. Ooh, I like how they actually transition from the from the people to the characters in game. Ooh, guys. It's like a corrupted version of 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 the character or uh, something like that or like some some darkness like for consuming them or something. It's your reflection looking back to pull you down. So you're gonna die today. Song so far I think it was a bit, yeah. When you have all these people, you know, like yo, we're going that one direction. We are going to achieve that, you know, that kind of thing. Awesome. All right. Wow. I did not actually. Um, I was surprised how deep the meaning is in this video and the empowerment of the message of this video as well. To be honest. <coughs> Sorry. Um. So Phoenix. Um. I think when, you know, in the description when it says destroy your doubt and face the future, uh, they really captured that moment whereby, um, as we all know, those pro players, uh, they have like, you know, their favorite champions or the co most common champions that they use 
um, in the games and stuff. And it's really nice that they actually captured that. And I like how this year there's a lot of um, Irelia that's being used in music videos as well because um, I. I mean, it, it's nice to see, you know, something different a bit. So, it, it's cool. So, maybe, I don't know, maybe next year they're gonna, like, imply someone else as, like, almost, like, the main character and stuff. So, I mean, that's that's that's, that's, that's nice to see. And um, I like how that they actually uh, portray in this music video that the biggest, the biggest obstacle is... In everyone, not just it's not just pro players level. No, if we were bring it down to even just like us players and bring it down to like a normal, um, daily, uh, people who are actually watching this video, they can actually relate to this kind of thing as well. It's not it's not just about those pro players trying to conquer their fear of losing in game and things like that. No, even in normal life as us, is actually we face our own fears of failures you know so that's very empowering and that's very it's a very good message that riot is trying to send to people you know you have to face your fear no matter what in order to overcome it and become better in you know whatever you're doing in life so um that is very awesome and cool in my opinion um the lyrics uh, it's 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 very. How to say? Um, it's very straightforward to be honest, and I like how they actually use Phoenix because, you know, like what what people say, like Phoenix, when they die, they will burn themselves, and then they are reborn through the ashes, right? So if you were to put it into a context of um, you know, the Phoenix context, um, basically, if you know, this we put it in like the world's context, correct? If they were actually to lose the game, so basically, in other words, they are they burn up, but from the ashes they are reborn again to become better and overcome all the fears that they have to fight or enter the next worlds, and you know become better, and you know, you know pull out pull through whatever that needs to be done. So it's very I mean the t- title is very I would say it's very nice uh, it gives a lot of messages uh, towards the people and um I, I don't know even though like we, even though this uh, League of Legends uh, worlds did not really have that um hype anthem that we usually have like you know um let's just say example uh, what was it called like the um with Imagine Dragons, you know, you have like the hype inside there, you know, where it builds and stuff. But this one is more towards very. Mm, it's 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 empowering on its own. I mean, in in terms of hype, of course, it's just okay. But the messaging and the, um, I would say, how am I supposed to put this? Um. Yeah, I don't know. It's more towards empowering people to understand what's going on rather than, you know, like, hyping up, like, yeah, those kind of things. But it still has it, its own kind of hype. So, um, yeah, I guess that's my take on Phoenix, though. Uh, I like how, you know, all the arts were put through inside in this because it really captures the moment that, you know, <clears throat> you know the people's fears... And, you know, the clone that's inside them that's blocking them, you know, from, like, pushing through forward. Because, you know, your own self-doubt is put- pulling you down instead of, like, pushing you through. So, that's why you see all those, like, corrupted, like, you know, um, the, the corrupted characters that you actually see. Even for the own players as well. Like, like for example, yeah, for this, as you can see, right, when they're fighting and stuff. And, yo. And I, I really like this part as well because, like I mentioned, it actually captures the, you know, the the fear that the, the, the people have. Because the biggest fear is actually, you know, it's actually from you and only other external things were actually affected. So I like how they actually captured, uh, you know, all this, all these details, you know, all these details that they put in. So... 
Yeah. Uh, tell me what you guys think about this year's um, world's anthem. I would like to know about uh, from you guys as well. I've always loved, uh, you know, reading all your comments and you know discussing with everybody about uh, you know about it. So uh, I'm gonna end the video here first. Um, if you have not liked and subscribed, do it now. Subscribe to my channel. It really means a lot to me. And um, yeah, don't forget to share as well if you guys think the video is awesome. So thumbs up to everybody. I'll see you guys in the next 2019. I'll see you guys in the next League of Legends reaction video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, hope to see you guys around. Bye.